What is up, you? I hope you're doing so, so good. I wanted to come today at you with um, with perhaps one of my favorite, absolute favorite focus hacks. So for those of you watching, go ahead. I want you to comment below where you're coming in from. Uh, I want you to hit up the like, the heart button so I know um, so I know where you're calling in from. And so I also know that you can hear me. So you may or may not be able to hear me. Jesse, what up, girl? We just spoke. That's awesome. Uh, or just had shared comments. I love it. Leanne, what's up guys? What's going on? What's up Liz? Um, so guys, I'm super, super excited to show this with you. So this is literally, uh, I would say probably one of my number one hacks. So what I've been doing is the last couple days, I love it. You're in La Costa, Jesse. Um, I love La Costa. I'm about, actually, I'm going to be going to La Costa in the next couple days. This is exciting. Timothy, what's up, dude? Good to see you, brother. Um, guys, the last couple days I've been sharing my favorite hacks on five days of focus challenge today is day number three what's up nicole i hope you're doing so good today ashley what up so guys this is literally my hands down favorite favorite tool i give this to my clients so this is this is like this is a big one it's hard to like really put a value on this is probably has saved my clients thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars um so, Timothy, to answer your question, my Tuesday is freaking rocking, man. Just got off an insane call with a client who was just like, just talking about all the incredible things she's doing as a mama, and she's just like, I feel like I finally am living my life from the inside out. So, um, and truly living a life on her terms. She feels like she's been kind of running around, picking up after everybody um, for the longest time, and now it finally feels like the world is kind of like landing in around her which is so, so exciting. So um, thank you so much for asking, Timothy, how my day's going. Um, so guys, focus. Here's the deal. Uh, I want to give you this tidbit today, and I'm so, so excited you guys are all on to get this. You ready? It's capturing distractions. Capturing distractions. And what do I mean by that? Really, really simple. I'm just going to give it to you guys, okay? There's no fluff here. Journal. Have your journal right next to you while you're working on a task. Have your journal right next to you while you're working on a task. We have 60,000 to 100,000 thoughts a day. If you're on the ADD attention deficit spectrum, you are moving closer to 100,000 thoughts a day. So 60,000 thoughts, that's one second per thought per waking hour. That's a lot of thoughts, people. So if you're working on something and you find yourself getting distracted and wanna like jump from this thing to that thing and try to doing all the multitasking deals, it done work, y'all. It done work, okay? So here is how you actually accomplish a task. And actually, the first day, right, we talked about closing the loop, right, is like finishing up a task to its completion. Here's how you do just that is you capture your distractions in a journal. It's literally that simple. It sounds so silly, but if you imagine yourself sitting down at a table trying to get work done and that brilliant idea comes to you and you're like, oh my gosh, I need to take action on this. I need to do this thing right now. No, you don't. No, you don't. That's just another dopamine rush. That's just another excitement and, and uh, adrenaline rush. But here's the other thing, guys, is that that idea may be golden. So my, my concept, my thought here is let's capture that idea. I don't want to say get rid of that idea. I think it's a great idea. So what you want to do is you want to capture it on paper so you can go back to it later. So I literally, if you saw my notebook right now, I wish I actually was holding my notebook right now. I have... I have pages and pages of ideas that come to me as I'm working on other things so that I'm not getting distracted by those distractions as they come up. I capture them, put them on paper, and they're there. So this is something I would literally share in the Supreme Performance Academy, in my course that's starting February 1st. I'd be sharing this in one of the modules, but I wanted to share it with you guys today um, because I wanted to give you something really, really valuable today. So I mean, literally, this will save you thousands and thousands and make you probably thousands and thousands of dollars because you're going to be able to finish and complete a task, um, which is just so, so exciting. So that's it today, guys. I wanted to give you that. That's my gift to you today is, is please take that and run with that. Please have a piece of paper, have a journal sitting next to you as you're working on something. Write it out. Thanks for all the love, guys. Good to see y'all. What's up, Lowell? What's up, Greg? So guys, I want you to actually share this. Like, I want you to actually send this to all your friends. I want you to comment below, tag your friends who you think 
or you've spoken with who want more focus, who want more productivity, because guys, this literally, focus thyself. I love it, Nikos. So guys, this is literally, this is something that has made me hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars, has been just simply and in, in closing clients and actually finishing things to completion, doing things on my website, doing things um, for my book. Like, Everything that I've done that's been able to help me focus has been a byproduct of having a journal right next to me as I'm doing the work. What up? Yeah, listen up. I love it, Timothy. So absolutely, having a journal next to you, having the ability, and here's the other thing, the reason it's a journal, guys, I'm going to get really, really specific with you. The reason why it's a journal in keeping your focus here, guys, is because if it's your phone, chances are you're going to get distracted and go do some other shit, right? So here's the thing is, and part of my French, but here's the thing, like keep it really analog. Keep it being just a pen and paper and have that there so you can have those brilliant ideas. You can write them down. You can even shorthand it really quick so that you can get right back to what you're focusing on. So that's it, guys. Uh, I'm sending you lots of love and I'm going to give you guys a gift today. I want to give you a really sweet gift. I've done this last couple days and everyone, every day someone's taking me up on it. So I want to offer it again. I'm going to offer for three people. If you have an issue around focus, um, I want to go ahead and I want to help you with that. So I'm going to give three people, the first three people to comment below or to shoot me a message. I'm I'm going to give you 15 minutes of my time and we're going to just absolutely crush that focus issue that you have and get you moving and, and shaking in the right direction. So go ahead, shoot me a message below, um, either in the comments or do it on the, on the, uh, the, the messenger. And, uh, I'm super excited to, I'm super excited to connect with y'all. So have an amazing, amazing day. Share this comment below, um, and, uh, have an incredible, incredible day guys. And here is to your focus and tomorrow day four, of the focus challenge super excited and remembering february 1st begins the supreme performance academy i'm so so excited for those of you that have already joined on and um excited for everyone that is still ready and excited to make it happen i'll talk to you guys so so soon have an incredible day peace